When Alex Fenton from Cigar.com asked me to produce a video called Jonathan Drew on Drew Estate, I became very inspired to reveal some of the inner workings of our humble factory in Esteli, Nicaragua. So let's take a trip. The production floor of Drew Estate is really an incredible sight. With over 400 rollers, making cigars completely by hand, using no machines of any kind, you could imagine that a day's work is truly exhausting. But quite frankly, there's no place on earth that I'd rather be than here. In Nicaragua, it's customary to produce cigars in a two-person team. A female rolera and a male bonchero will place the leaves perfectly in position to make the cigars have a perfect construction, a perfect burn, and a perfect draw every time. Each bonchero and rolero has been trained to make a custom blend and stick within the boundaries of this blend. What we do to ensure that the cigar is being produced the correct way all day long is we have supervisors walk the production floor and check the quality every 15 minutes. Therefore, we'll never have a 15 minute span where we have any problem with any cigar being made. Keeping quality high and maintaining your direct costs is an incredibly important function of making premium cigars. There's a discipline here, a necessary level of patience that's imperative, that must be followed. Making cigars for me and for any truly great cigar manufacturer is a labor of love. It's a passion from the heart. But we really, at all times, have to stay focused on each cigar, making sure that each cigar has the quality, has the draw, has the construction that creates uniformity so that every single product coming out of the Drew Estate factory is exceptional. It's these guys here, the supervisors, who day in and day out make sure that all of the products that we make are of the highest integrity. This is one of the most important aspects of the entire company. So now we'll explore a whole other area of Drew Estate called the packaging area. This is where all of the products finally come to life in the finishing form. Let me tell you, I still love coming to the packaging area at Drew Estate. This is where the final steps are laid for the cigars to finally go to the retail stores and ultimately the final consumers. In this area, we place the bands on the cigars. We meticulously place the cigars into the boxes, all color coordinated and just absolutely beautiful. We have a tremendous staff here in the packaging department and plenty of supervisors to make sure that everything is done right every single time. We happen to be standing in the coffee infused section of the factory. This is where we do the packaging work for uh, Tobacco Especial, for Java Latte, and for Java Negro. This is where we do the Isla del Sol and the Legends brand that we do for Cigars International. It's a busy area, there's a lot of movement, but it's a uh, very important area of the factory. This is the area of the factory that we call the color sorting area. This is where we break down all of the different shades of the cigars to be able to unify everything and get them in boxes that are all color coordinated. It's just really hair splitting details that make the pride and the passion for the cigars really take its final, final hold. And this gentleman, there's no better color sorter than this gentleman. It takes a lot of years to be able to get to this level where you're able to move at a rate, ensure quality, and select the most beautiful wrapper for the presentation. Each aspect of Drew Stage is designed with a sense of style that's our very own. It reflects our passion for making cigars, Latin living, and it reflects the passion that we have for art in any degree. The wall behind us is a very special, special mural called Dos Formas. It means two forms in Spanish. It was the design of the revolutionary artists in Nicaragua combined with the urban artists who work day in, day out here at Nicaragua. This is a wonderful piece of art. It would be impossible to make a video called Jonathan Drew on Drew Estate without showcasing the subculture art studio to some degree. The connectivity between subculture studio and Drew Estate is something that started over eight years ago with the Fusion crew and it's something that we've taken and incorporated into every stitch of work that we do. It transcends the United States, transcends Nicaragua. You know, it's part of the entire package. Well, I would like to thank Alex Swenson, 
for asking me to make this Jonathan Drew on Drew Estate video. Obviously, I've left out a lot of nooks and crannies that are really important. It was really my goal today to give you a good idea of what it's like, you know, working here at the Drew Estate Factory in Esteli, Nicaragua. I hope that you found it to be interesting and I hope to see you on the www.cigarsafari.com tours and we look forward to seeing you here at the factory. We're going to have a nice time together.